guys, it's Brandon, also known as Slyther, and we are in uh, New Hampshire, Manchester, actually. Uh, there's a river down there, I know it's super dark, you can't really see, but um, I bet you're wondering why, one, I'm not vlogging in my room like I normally do, and two, why I'm not even in Rhode Island. Uh, well, for Thanksgiving, um, I got invited, one, to New York, which was three hours away, or two, to Vermont, which is another three hours away. Um, in New York is uh, my buddy from the Daily Titan, the newspaper that I used to work for. Um, and I told him that like I'd love to go down there and see because I've never been to New York. But uh, the other invite that I got was with uh, the girl that I have made vague mention of and that's something you've picked up on. Um, and she is actually driving, which is why I'm not, you know, stuff like that. You can't even see her and you probably won't. Mystery. Um, <laughs> uh, but her name is Rose, and that's kind of a thing. So we're going to go up to see uh, her family, and yeah, it should be fun. Now, this was an absolute blast. It was up at Rose's sister's house, uh, way, way up in the woods, and it's super quintessential. They have a cabin out there that I guess they made, and uh, Thanksgiving dinner was just so perfect and wonderful. I uh, got to shoot a 12 gauge shotgun like with clay pigeons and just everything about it was seemed so American. Um, but it was really cool going up there and just having that like backwoods cabin experience. Hey guys, Brandon also known as Slyther. We just spent uh, Thanksgiving at a cabin in the woods. Uh, probably tossed in a couple of pictures prior. Um, that is Luna. No, she's not going to say hi. Okay. Um, I'm about to go over to Rose's relatives right now and um, should be home by tonight. So, yeah, I'll see you guys soon. I love this property. It's just a real honest-to-goodness New England farm. It's the only way I know how to describe it. Just the forest everywhere, the tree line. It's definitely really different from what I'm used to. So we were actually on our way home, but it was getting a little late and we were really hungry. So we decided to stop for dinner at this really, really cute touristy town uh, in Vermont. <laughs> Only in New England would you have an entire store devoted to flannel. How do I feel like this is the center of Vermont? So we got a couple of uh, touristy knickknacks and we stopped at this cafe that was um, like a local fresh farm kind of thing. And it's the first place that I've seen a maple latte. Um, all of the buildings were like 230 some years old and there was the oldest bridge in Vermont. That's about it for the trip, guys. Hope you had an awesome Thanksgiving. Take care. Have a good one.